All right, hey guys, it's Jamie Walker with You Move Fit at 2084 College Ave in Elmira Heights, New York. Um, so this week, we had a couple questions with the workout. Uh, this, this week's workout, we are working on eccentric motion. We're putting all the focus on the eccentric motion. So um, with that said, eccentric means that you're working on the, it's not really lengthening the muscle, but you're working on, so this is concentric on the bicep, and this is eccentric. So your muscles don't actually shrink, they don't shorten or lengthen, they actually work like a sliding glass door, so they're always the same length. They just kind of stack on top of each other, they slide together, and then they slide apart. Um, but for, for conversations, you know, just for this week, I'm going to say shorten and lengthen, all right? Um, so this week, we're working on the lengthening of the muscles, so stretching that out, all right? So eccentric, here we go. This week's workout, I hope you guys can see this. We're working on um, these three sets. We're doing each set two times, and then um, we're going 45 seconds on, 20 seconds break. And in between each of these, I'll show you what's going on. In between each, once we get to the last one of the second set, we're going right into 30 seconds each of burpees, jumping jacks, push-ups, squat jumps, and then rest. All right, after this first set, we're gonna do that one time. After the second set, Yep, we're doing it two times. So you get that burpees, jumping jacks, push-ups, squat jumps, rest. All of these are 30 seconds, no rest anywhere other than here. All right, and then after the third set, you guessed it, here we go, three times, burpees, jumping jacks, push-ups, squat jumps, and rest, repeat, three times, all right? Other than that, these sets are 45 seconds on, 20 seconds rest, and then two times through. All right, so let's work on, let's go through these. So you can see what's kind of going on. All right guys, for your push-up, all right, your push-up, you're working on the eccentric motion of the push-up. You're right here, and you're working on going down slow, because right now we're working on back here, your tricep, all right? So you're here, all the way down, take three to four seconds, you know, maybe five, all the way down, then explode back up, all right? Down slow, and then explode back up. I don't care about the explode back up part. Um, if you wanted to, you can, you're right here going down slow and then drop to your knees, push back, go back up into that push up. All right? So, same way, same idea with the squat. All right? Um, I'm going to use a chair. You know, at home, you're going to grab a chair and you're going to work on this, right? You're going to be here and you're going to get your squat. Don't rest on the seat. You're here. As soon as your butt touches, go back up. Slow, three, four, back up, all right? So that's the squat. Then we have a dip. Same thing with the dip, all right? You're right here. You're working that motion. You're going down slow, two, three, four, back up. Two, three, four, back up, all right? So you're working on slow down and then speed back up. Um, and then single leg calf raise. You might want to grab your chair um, just for balance because you really don't have to work on balance here. But you're going to grab your chair and you're going to go up and then slow down. Here, I'm going to grab a chair right here. Pick that leg, that leg up, one leg up. You're going to explode up, down, two, three, four, back up two, three, four, just, so we're working on that eccentric motion. That's set number one. Set number two, we have a split squat. So your split squat is you're going in that lunge position, all right, but you're gonna stay here, you're not gonna step. And you're gonna go down, two, three, four, making sure this knee's not going above your toe or pushing forward, come back, so your, this part of your leg, the lower part of your leg stays still, it doesn't move back and forth. And you're going straight down, two, three, four, back up, as fast as you can, two, three, four, back up, all right? And then make sure you guys switch sides the second time through anything, you're staying on one side. Um, with your sit-up, so your sit-up, you're right here, you're working on, um, get your feet underneath your couch, right? Or some, you know, have someone hold your feet down, because I really want you working on this part of it, the lengthening, one, two, three, four. As soon as your lower back hits, don't rest down here. As soon as your lower back hits, 
explode back up. And then two, three, four, explode up. All right? Working on slow on the way down, explode on the way back up. And then we have a standing side bend. So you can do this with or without weight. All of these, if you add weight to any of these, you're gonna get more out of it, um, but you don't have to by all means. So you're standing side bend, I am gonna grab a kettlebell, and you're right here. And you are bending at the side, two, working here, two, three, four, and then explode back up. Two, three, four, explode back up. All right, that's your standing side bend. And then a double leg lift. All right, double leg lift, it's just what it sounds like. You're, you're lifting both legs. All right, so here, and you're down. Two, three, four, and then as soon as your heels touch, right there, you can either leave your legs straight and go back up. Two, three, four, and then if you, again, I'm not worried about the concentric, just the eccentric. If once your feet get down to the bottom, you're here, you can bend your knees and come back up. Two, three, four, and then bend your knees if you want to, all right? You don't have to, you can leave your legs straight, but you are working on slowing that eccentric motion down. So that's number two. Don't forget, you are doing your 30 second burpees, jumping jacks, push up, squat, and rest in between each one, all right? In between, right here in the lines are. You can do two sets of these and then one time. Two sets of these and then two times. And then two sets of these three times. All right? So then the last set we have, 45 seconds, is diamond push-ups. Diamond push-ups, your hands are like this, in the shape of a diamond right here, all right? Diamond push-ups. And you want your hands to go to the center of your chest, your elbows will go back, you really work, you'll feel that in your triceps here. You're going down slow, and then as soon as your hands hit your chest, push back up as fast as you can. All right, so you're right here. Hands in the shape of a diamond or a triangle. You don't have to have your thumbs out like that, but I like to, because they're called diamond push-ups. So you're right here. Down, two, three, four. As soon as your hands hit, explode back up. And then slow on the way down. If you want to, do these from your knees. That's perfectly okay. Right here. And then explode back up. If Once you get down here, it's okay. Remember, push back. I'm not really worried about the concentric motion. I'm right here. Down. Two. Three. Four. Back up. Two. Three. Four. And then back up. All right? And then we have a double cap raise. This is the same as the single, but both at the same time. You're up, so up as fast as you can. Two, three, four, up. Two, three, four. Again, add weight to any of these. You're gonna get a lot more out of it. Um, side lunge, this is the one where you have a nice wide stance here. If you have weight, you can put one weight here, one weight here, or you can hold the goblet, like a goblet with a squat, but you're gonna do that side lunge. All right, so you're here. Make sure your hips go back first. Knee bends as your hips go down and then back up. So down, two, three, back up quick. Down, two, three, and then explode back up. All right? And then, uh, so let's do that one from the side so you can kind of see it. You're right here. Your hips go back first, knee, bends, but it does, it's not going out this way, over your ankle, it's going forward in the direction of your toe, right there, down, two, three, four, explode back up, all right, and then the last thing we have is a single leg lift, so it's just like the double, except we're working on this one, this leg wants to stay straight on the ground, trying to bend it, you want that leg straight, and if you can only get to here, that's perfectly fine. Go up as far as you can, and then you're dropping it, two, three, four, and then explode it back up while this leg stays straight on the ground. Two, three, four, back up. If you want more out of it, you can get in that crunch position. Two, three, four, back up. And then the second time through, guys, switch sides. All right? 
So that's kind of what we have here. I'm going to show you this one more time so you guys can get it. All right, so remember, this side over here is 45 seconds on, 20 seconds off, and you're going through two times. Once you hit after this first one, you're shooting over, and you're doing this set. 30 seconds each, no breaks, until you get to your rest. All right, you go through it one time after that set, two times after that set, and three times after your third set. All right, guys, if you have any questions, by all means, you know, just send me a message. Um, you can... Uh, let me know however way you can. Go to our website um, and just let me know. Talk to me. All right, guys. Have a great week. Let me know what you think. Talk to you later. Bye.